वेलकम फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट क्रोमेटोग्राफी इफ यू लाइक माई वीडियोज देन क्लिक द लाइक बटन सब्सक्राइब माई यूट्यूब चैनल क्लिक ऑन द बेल आइकन टू गेट नोटिफिकेशन एंड शेयर टू योर फ्रेंड्स The overview of wall video of chromatography is first one what is chromatography what do you mean by chromatography and how it is going on second one what is the history of chromatography which scientist developed the chromatography and give their contribute to the chromatography and what are the basic terms that is related to chromatography that defines chromatography very well and then what are the types of chromatography that is major types of chromatography now look into at the chromatography it is comes from the two greek word that is chroma it means color and second one is graphene graphene means to write now it is the laboratory technique for the separation of biochemical mixtures based on the distribution or the partition coefficient which describe the way in which a compound the analyte distributes between two immiscible phases now the chromatography is mainly the separation based technique that distributes the mixture of biochemical compounds in two phases the two phases are stationary phase or mobile phase now what is mobile phase it is the mixture that dissolve in the fluid it called mobile phase and stationary phase that is stationary static in nature and made up of solid gel liquid or solid liquid mixture and the mobile phase that is liquid or gaseous form the mobile phase along with the analyte you want to separate that is traveled over the stationary phase and it is distribute or se- separate between two phases based on their difference in distribution coefficient history of chromatography is it is first employed in the russia by the italian born scientist misali tiswet in 19th century he separated the plant pigment such as chlorophyll carotenoids and xanthophylls then it is later developed in 1940s and 1950s by john porter and lawrence mistel now looking toward the basic term that defines the chromatography very well and we are going to detail of each terms first one that is what is stationary phase then mobile phase then what is illusion then what is illusion volume then what is illusion time and then void volume and retention time and retention factor and then what is chromatogram and then it is resolution now we are going to detail of each term the first one that is stationary phase that stays inside the column and it is most commonly a viscous medium that placed on the surface of column and the mobile phase that solvents moving throughout the column in chromatography it is either liquid or gaseous in nature and then what is illusion the wall process of passing liquid or gas throughout the column is called illusion then what is illusion volume illusion volume the volume of illuent that is required to cause illusion the initial volume that is called illusion volume then illusion time the time that between start of the separation at which 
the solute enter into the column and time at which solute elutes that is called elution time then void volume the void volume is the volume of free space is called void volume it means by if the stationary phase occupies the 40% of the total column volume then the void volume would be 60% of total column volume now what is retention time it means by it is a measure of the time taken to solute to pass throughout the column it is called retention time then what is chromatogram chromatogram is the picture record of the detector in response as a function of retention time or elution volume then what is resolution resolution is the ability to separate two peaks from one to another is called resolution now the types of chromatography in which the major type that is adsorption chromatography then partition chromatography then ion exchange chromatography and then molecular exclusion chromatography and the affinity chromatography now first we are going to discuss about adsorption chromatography in the adsorption chromatography if you see the molecules are get adsorbed towards the stationary phase that is on the surface of stationary phase if it is more absorbed then it travels slowly throughout the column then what is the partition chromatography in the partition chromatography in which it is mainly based on the liquid stationary phase solubility if the if the molecules with the mobile phase you want to separate it is soluble in the liquid stationary phase it is gets diluted later and then ion exchange chromatography in the ion exchange chromatography there is a two type of ions that is anions and cations are covalently attached to the stationary phase and the molecules you want to separate that contains the opposite charge that is attached to the stationary phase and then it is eluted and separated then size exclusion chromatography in the size exclusion chromatography it depends on the separation of molecules based on their size if the molecules are large mole size molecule then it is later eluted because it cannot enter into the pores and the small molecules that eluted faster because it can enter into the pores now what is affinity chromatography as shown in the figure the binding affinity is mainly principle of affinity chromatography if there is molecule bind with higher affinity then eluted later and this video of chromatography if you like then click the like button subscribe my youtube channel and click on the bell icon to get notification and share to your friends thanks for watching